Hi friends, we're back and today I'm joined by my friend Dilly. Dilly is an armadillo. Armadillos are such interesting animals. They have a soft little head and paws and tail, but most of their body is covered by this very, very hard bony covering and that protects them. It protects them from predators and it even protects them from things like like gnats and flies and, and stinging bugs. In the southwest part of our country where I used to live, you will very often see armadillos scurrying across the road to try to get to the other side very quickly because they live out in the wild and they don't really like things like traffic and cars and trucks. They like to be close to their burrows but sometimes when they have to cross an expanse of roadway or highway, they really take off running. And there's one kind of armadillo that you don't see too much in the U.S. It's called a three-banded armadillo. And when they're scared or feeling threatened or feeling like there's something in the environment that they need protection from, they are actually able to curl their bodies up into a little ball and roll. And that's a way that they protect themselves. Well, you know, friends, you and I, we're not like Dilly, we're not armadillos, but there are times when we feel kind of vulnerable. We might feel like we're being attacked. Uh, in times like that, when you feel vulnerable, when people are saying things that are hurtful to you or that are not true about you or there's some other situation where you just feel like wow I feel like I need protection did you know that you can go inside with your thought and with your breathing and there's some mudra that can help you feel safe and feel protected hey Dilly you know what I need to use both my hands to show this combined mudra and so, is it okay with you if I put you down just for a moment? Yeah, it's okay? Okay, I'll be right back. So I'm gonna put Dilly right here. And this way you can see both my hands. Today we're going to do what's known as a combined mudra, which is you do one mudra with your right hand and another different mudra with your left hand. You just do them at the same time. The breathing that I like to put with this combined mudra is seven, seven. We put our right hand in front of us in abaya, which is the mudra of protection. And we put our left hand in bu, which is witness. And so when you have your right hand in protection and your left hand in witness, you are calling on the earth and all that's around you to see and to witness that you are safe, that you are protected, that you can feel a sense of less vulnerability. And so, we put our right hand in this mudra, we put our left hand in the Bu mudra, and we inhale to the count of seven through our nose, and exhale to the count of seven through our lips. Let's try. And... Yes, and you can do this combined mudra as frequently as you would like to and as many repetitions as you would like to. I often find that when I stop, pause for a moment, and do this breathing and this combined mudra, that I feel more of a sense of safety and that I feel like I can move forward. Well, Dilly, we do not have armor like you, the armadillo. Did you know, Dilly, that armadillo means little armored one in Spanish? You didn't know that? Well, now you know. You are the little armored one. But we do now have some breathing and some mudra that can help us feel more confidence. Friends, I hope some time today, tonight, tomorrow, whenever, if you're feeling that sense of vulnerability, you really will try this combined mudra and this breathing, and then that will help. Well, Dilly, it's time to wave goodbye to our friends at home. Would you like to wave goodbye? You what? Bye-bye, friends. See you soon. Friends.
friends, Dilly and I hope you have a great rest of the day. We'll see you again soon. Bye-bye.